A reading from the book of Joshua. Today is July 21st. Our reading from Joshua is chapter 15. The portion that fell by lot to the various clans of the tribe of Judah lay farthest south, down to the border of Edom, which is the wilderness of Zin. Their southern boundary began from the tip of the Dead Sea, from the tongue that projects southward. It proceeded to the south of the ascent of Akrabim, passed on to Zin, ascended to the south of Kadesh Barnea, passed on to Hezron, ascended to Adar, and made a turn to Karka. From there it passed on to Asmon and proceeded to the Wadi of Egypt, and the boundary ran on to the sea. That shall be your southern boundary. The boundary on the east was the Dead Sea up to the mouth of the Jordan. On the northern side, the boundary began at the tongue of the sea at the mouth of the Jordan. The boundary ascended to Beth Hogla and passed north of Beth Araba. Then the boundary ascended to the stone of Bohan, son of Reuben. The boundary ascended from the valley of Achor to Debir and turned north to Gilgal, facing the ascent of Adumim, which is south of the Wadi. From there, the boundary continued to the waters of En Shemesh and ran on to En Ragel. Then the boundary ascended into the valley of Ben Hinnom along the southern flank of the Jebusites, that is, Jerusalem. The boundary then ran up to the top of the hill which flanks the valley of Hin Hinnom on the west at the northern end of the valley of Rephaim. From that hilltop, the boundary curved to the fountain of the waters of Nephtua and ran on to the towns of Mount Ephron. Then the boundary curved to Bala, that is, Kirath Jerim. From Bala, the boundary turned westward to Mount Seir, passed north of the slope of Mount Jerim, that is, Chesalon, descended to Beth Shemesh, and passed on to Timnah. The boundary then proceeded to the northern flank of Ekron. The boundary curved to Shikaron, passed on to Mount Bala, and proceeded to Jabneel, and the boundary ran on to the sea. And the western boundary was the edge of the Mediterranean Sea. Those were the boundaries of the various clans of the Judites on all sides. In accordance with the Lord's command to Joshua, Caleb, son of Jephunneh, was given a portion among the Judites, namely Kiriath Arba, that is Hebron. Arba was the father of Anak. Caleb dislodged from there the three Anakites, Sheshai, Ahiman, and Talmai, descendants of Anak. From there he marched again against the inhabitants of Debir. The name of Debir was formerly Kirath Sephir, and Caleb announced, I will give my daughter Aksa in marriage to the man who attacks and captures Kirath Sephir. His kinsman Othniel, the Kenzanite, captured it, and Caleb gave him his daughter Aksa in marriage. When she came to him, she induced him to ask her father for some property. She dismounted from her donkey, and Caleb asked her, What is the matter? She replied, Give me a present, for you have given me away as Negeb land, so give me springs of water. And he gave her upper and lower Goath. This was the portion of the tribe of the Judites by their clans. The towns at the far end of the tribe of Judah, near the border of Edom, in the Negeb, were Kabzeel, Eder, Jager, Kenneth, Dimana, Adada, Kedesh, Hazor, Ithnan, Zif, Telem, Beeloth, Hazor Hadatha, Kiriath Hezron, that is Hazor, Aman, Shema, Moada, Hazar Gada, Heshman, Beth Pellet, Hazar Shual, Beersheba, Bezothia, Bala, Im, Izil, Eltolad, Chesil, Horma, Ziklag, Madmana, Sansana, Lebeoth, Shilhim, Ain, and Rimen. Total 29 towns with their villages. In the lowland, Eshtael, Zora, Ashnan, Zanoa, Enganim, Tapua, Enam, Jarmuth, Adulam, Soko, Azika, 
Sharem, Adathain, Gadara, and Gedarathain, 14 towns with their villages. Zenon, Hadasha, Migdal Gad, Dillon, Mizpah, Jokthil, Lashish, Bozkath, Eglon, Kavan, Lamas, Chiflish, Gedaroth, Begdagon, Nema, and Makeda, 16 towns with their villages. Libna, Ether, Ashen, Ifta, Ashna, Nezib, Kelia, Agzib, and Maresha, nine towns with their villages. Ekron with its dependencies and villages, from Ekron westward, all the towns in the vicinity of Ashdod with their villages, Ashdod, its dependencies and villages, Gaza, its dependencies and its villages, all the way to the Wadi of Egypt and the edge of the Mediterranean Sea. And in the hill country, Shamir, Jatir, Soko, Dana, Kiriath Sana, that is Debir, Anab, Eshtema, Anim, Goshen, Holan, and Gila, eleven towns with their villages. Arab, Duma, Eshen, Janum, Beth Tapwa, Afeka, Humta, Kiriath Arba, that is Hebron, and Zior, nine towns with their villages. Maon, Carmel, Ziph, Judah, Jesriel, Jokdiam, Zanua, Cain, Gibeath, and Timnon, ten towns with their villages. Halhu, Bethzur, Gedor, Marath, Beth Anoth, and Eltikon, six towns with their villages. Kiriath Baal, that is Kiriath Jerim, and Rabbah, two towns with their villages. In the wilderness, Beth Araba, Midden, Sikaka, Nishban, Irmela, and Engedi, six towns with their villages. But the Judites could not dispossess the Jebusites, the inhabitants of Jerusalem. So the Judites dwell with the Jebusites in Jerusalem to this day.